Okay, so we we'll ask that we are here. Uh, what's the name of this place? This place is known as Child Care and Adoption Society of Zambia, Dollar Transit Home. Transit Home. So these children, when uh, they come here, do you keep them for long, or and how do you get them? Where do they come from? Okay, being a transit home, it depends on the needs. And the needs. But they come in and go. All right. And come near Shikana. What brings them here? Uh, various circumstances. Circumstances. Yes. yes. Yeah. Like uh, death of the mother. Of the mother. Yeah. yeah. Or mother being uh, incarcerated for a long time. Yeah. Yes. In prison. In prison for a longer time. Yeah. Others, it's it's because of. Poverty. Poverty. Yeah. Where they can't afford. That's right. Come near to them. Yeah. Others, it is it is simply because the relatives cannot provide for them. Right. For them. So they are them. Yeah. 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 Others come from uh, the hospital. Right. Say a young mother who is not prepared to have a child. Child. Is pregnant and doesn't need that or doesn't want that want child. child. Mm -hmm. So in pretense of coming to the hospital, the hospital deliver, is just to yes, leave and, the baby. and just abandon the baby and run away. Uh, yeah. Right. Others are abandoned in the compounds. In the compounds. Yes. Um, others are left in the toilets, mm -hmm. at market places. Yeah. And we get them through social welfare. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Oh, so some of them are referred to this yeah, place uh, from the social yes. uh, services uh, to come and uh, have shelter. Yes. Have shelter here. In fact, um, social welfare. Uh, that's the department which has got the authority over all the children, the children in, Zambia. in Zambia. So whatever is happening to a child needs to be reported to social to social welfare. welfare. So right. that uh, they follow up, follow up and the they also make sure that we are given a consent. A consent. A consent from the courts. From the courts. Yeah. Oh, so right. that the child is okay. is bound okay. here bound. and protected. Yeah. And in in the process of say changing place. Let's say like if relatives want that yes. child back into the family. Reports should be so the report has to be, yes. to be returned. Okay. One given to the family, we remain with the copy, with the copy. and also social, social welfare. welfare. Yeah. All right. That's okay. the way government tracks That's the, how children how are children moving. Are, yes. are moving. All right. So in this home, in this transit uh, home here uh, in Indola, uh, sometimes when you have uh, full capacity, how many children do you normally uh, get? Our uh, full capacity is 30. 30? Yeah. All right. Yeah. Okay, so you can only take up to 30? Up to 30. Okay. Beyond, right. beyond that, it would be difficult. Difficult to, to manage. To manage, yes. All right. But we also have another program. Okay. In the in the communities. In the communities. When the children are discharged, yeah. we follow them up to see how to they see are faring. How they're faring okay. or what what sort of issues they are mm. facing. Yeah. And so on and so forth. And mm. even progress. Yeah, to see if they are making progress. Then we, we document, document and report and report social services. Yes. Yes. In terms of education, because they come from backgrounds where no one is uh, willing to look after them and they come, do you provide education yes. uh, for them? Yes. And how is it done? <coughs> this is a class. That's, okay. that, that's the beginning. Yeah. yeah. They, 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 they start of education, they start from here. From here. Can you then see, see the... Oh, uh, right. Can yes. you see the pictures on the sides? Okay. Yes. So this is one of the classrooms uh, the where classroom. they start from. You yes. begin to... Yes. Teach them. Do you assess them to say this one can go to grade one, yes. grade two, grade what? There's, okay. a, there's actually a professional teacher. Teacher. Yeah. Okay. Who runs with them? Yeah. And recommends who is ready to go to grade to one. Grade one. And so on and so forth. All right. Yes. Okay. That's very good. And we have their reports in my office. In their office. Yeah. Okay. 
So then those who qualify, we usually take them to the to this government school. Consensual, consensual, consensual yes. school. All right. So in other words, you've got a partnership with the government. Yes. yes. Those who need to go into school, yes. uh, they go into mainstream education. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. And then we follow with our sponsorship. With the sponsorship. The sponsorship is given to the school. To the school. To all right. So in terms of sponsorship, who sponsored? Uh, who sponsors the children? Uh, is it uh, from the family, from the government, or individuals can he, uh, can he, uh, sponsor a child? Usually, it's individuals. Okay. Um, other sectors, it's difficult to to come in to manage to manage, manage because the family are not able to provide. To provide for able the to children. provide, they would keep them. Then government also uh, sometimes they help, yeah. but they facilitate. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. All right. No, that's uh, that's very good. But in terms of uh, paying the teachers and also managing uh, uh, the transit home, how do you how do you manage? We have a board. All right. So the board sits. Yeah. And the formulates policies. Uh, like uh, the policy, how to how to go around the community and find money for money running this for running a yeah. project. Yeah, okay. and also a director. Okay, who sort of sits he here. sits here to make yeah. sure, make sure uh, that uh, things are, are going. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, all right. No, that's uh, that's very very uh, good. And uh, what happens when they grow up, they go to secondary school, uh, do you track them uh, from uh, the time you started? Yes. Uh, do you have uh, maybe like a record to see like the children who have passed through this home or transit home, how they are doing and uh, whether they are the first group that came or going to college or they have gotten married, any, any kind of uh, uh, story uh, about some children? Very successful stories. Yeah. Um, one of the successful story is that um, there was um, a, a Danish couple that adopted children from here. From here. Very small. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, they are now. Is it Netherlands? Netherlands. Yeah, Netherlands. And those have finished school. School. And they are even working. Oh, that's very when good. they come back to Zambia, to Zambia, they don't know any of the Zambian languages. <laughs> <laughs> they only can speak that uh, language that's from. Language. That's right. I know. I yeah. Know. But those children, uh, uh, are they working? Uh, do yes. they contribute something towards uh, the orphanage? Have they been told the story of where they are coming from? Uh, another one was adopted from here. Yeah. The when. Do, uh, went into a normal home. Yeah. Grew up there. Yeah. Was sent to university in oh, South right. Africa. Oh, that's and he has just done. He has just finished his, his uh, university, and he's working. Amen. He usually yeah. comes here comes to, to yeah. visit and to visit encourage and encourage others. Uh, so, children, are you listening? Uh, one of your friends, as uh, Papa is saying, uh, is going to school, going to university now, finished. That's a very successful story and we pray that each one of you, you also go to school, finish your education, go to secondary school, go to university and start working and help uh, other, other children. Uh, okay, that's very, that's very encouraging. Yeah, otherwise we are happy. And also to our colleagues, our Zambians in the diaspora and also any other person in the world that would want to help here is an opportunity. We've got these lovely, lovely children and people that are looking after, after these precious uh, children. If you need help or you need to connect with uh, uh, this uh, Ndola Transit uh, Home here in Chintu Street Avenue uh, in Ndola, you are most welcome. Uh, we can link you up with uh, this uh, great work. Uh, being done in this place and also we want to just appreciate uh, Zigba and Faiza and also uh, Mila in Birmingham for donating uh, uh, the clothes and things that you donated 
Shekina and the Eliezer. We just want to say thank you uh, for giving and also time uh, to say we want to go and see where our friends are. Uh, Faiza and, uh, and Sigba, Mila, they sent clothes for children. Some of the people that sent you some clothes uh, in Birmingham. Mila, she works in the eye clinic at uh, Heartlands. She can, are you able to see us? Don't turn the camera down. Yes, they are able to, uh, to send you things and we just want to say thank you so much and uh, everybody that has contributed and we will continue to remember uh, this uh, great way. Uh, maybe just uh, finally, how do you uh, manage and pay the teachers? Is it voluntary or they have to be paid something? They have to be paid a regular monthly salary. Salary. Yes. Yeah. And um, after they work, there is a, a gratuity. All right. Yes. Okay. After gratuity, there is also terminal benefits. Terminal benefits that yeah. they have to yeah, yeah to get for the work that they are they are right. doing. So knowing that uh, you are a non-profit uh, organization, uh, how do you manage the salaries uh, for our teachers and the volunteers yes. that work, the food and everything? Yes. We 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 depend on the goodwill of, of, people, of people. people, those who come through. Yeah. Uh, some people have been with us for a long time, yeah. and of course some have pulled out. Mm. But we thank God that the work is going, it's going and on. We are also seeing uh, other people coming on board. Yes. Okay. So maybe finally, in terms of. Uh, help and need, what are some of the areas that uh, you think you, you need help and agent help? Uh, for example, if somebody wants to help but they don't know where to start from. For example, we just came thinking to say, okay, we can donate clothes, but apart from uh, clothes for our beloved uh, brothers and sisters in this home, are there some specific areas or what are some of the areas that uh, you you need help as a, a transit home uh, for these uh, precious uh, precious uh, people. Okay, uh, like the daily running of the home, of the home, meaning of you have to supply electricity, electricity, you have to pay rent, bills. Yes, rent, pay the bills and uh, pay the mothers. The mothers who, who are looking after the them. Yes. Okay. Um, when they fall sick, you take them to the hospital. To the hospital, so you yeah. need uh, hospital fees. We have hospital fees and also general maintenance of, of, of the place. surrounding. Keep the, the surroundings nice and clean. That's true. Yeah, and healthy for the children. For the children. Yeah. Okay. We do have a borehole. Yeah. So we have sufficient, sufficient water, water but to run, run that to run that you need uh, electricity, electricity yeah. to pump water yes. in there yes. all right okay so we see then there are a lot of needs yeah yeah we just pray and see what uh, what can be done okay so children uh much wish uh, uh, you can look straight uh, to Shekaina and uh, Dorothy. Fish wing ever one to Avale Avale Afisha. Uh, much wish we got a more planda po. Do we catch your question? Fish wing got a more planda po and to Avale Afisha. Nangawe of fire of me of Felicia. Lantisha, you want to say thank you? Yes. All right, uh, very good. Uh, uh, Elizabeth, much wish we got a more plan. What do you want to say to people that are helping and those that would want to help? To our Nam Chuan. To our Nam Chuan. Not to a teller. Okay, Ngafim, fish we got a more plan. Our Swedish or our one to Valen Valen Pella. Okay, just want to say to our hotel. Okay, now Paul, Paul, fish we got a Moklanda go, Kuban, no other name of Swedish, now in the fire of Swedish, much wish we got a Moklanda po. Tatela Sana, thank you very much. 
Okay. Finish we got them over me still a corner film B. Commissioner of Pama Boke of School. Nice film B. And then fish. I'm a penny of school. In so called she, a masco uniforms. Okay, what else is we got them one? In Sapato, my fiola of Yapu school. All right, thank you. Nish we got a mobile and a Sana. Thank you very much. The mother there, the mother, Mwaba Sungava, and Mwabo, Fishy Mungata Mopula and Apuan Tavalia Fuisha, and if you want that a morning be a bank of fire for a Fuisha, so that he buys you of that hour and then so who if you are for anything. Thank you very much for these donations and our request is as mothers. Yeah. Thank you so much. So we need to remember the mothers who look after uh, these children uh, that uh, we can support them even in a small way, a salary or anything that they can use uh, at this transit uh, home. Otherwise, uh, we appreciate so much uh, for welcoming us. Uh, this is in Dollar Dollar Transit Home. Dollar Transit Home. Uh, it's uh, situated in Chintu. Uh, is it Avenue or Road? Uh, Chintu, Chintu Avenue. Chintu Avenue in Kansenshi in Indola on the Copper Belt. Uh, that's Zambia in the southern uh, hemisphere uh, of Africa. Lovely people. We appreciate our time here today. With my two girls, Shekaina and Eliezer. Shekaina, thank you also for the contribution. And Eliezer, the things that you donated, uh, it will go a long way. Otherwise, thank you so much and God literally bless you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Bye.